Welcome to our channel. In this video, we will be reading Psalms chapter 34 from the Bible, a beautiful passage that speaks to the heart of faith and trust in God. This chapter reminds us to seek refuge in the Lord and to find joy in His presence. It highlights themes of gratitude, deliverance, and the power of worship. As we read, take a moment to reflect on the blessings in your life and the comfort that faith can bring. Let's dive into this timeless scripture and embrace its message together. Enjoy. Psalms chapter 34. I will extol the Lord at all times. His praise will always be on my lips. I will glory in the Lord. Let the afflicted hear and rejoice. Glorify the Lord with me. Let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord and he answered me. He delivered me from all my fears. Those who look to him are radiant. Their faces are never covered with shame. This poor man called and the Lord heard him. He saved him out of all his troubles. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him, and he delivers them. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the one who takes refuge in him. Fear the Lord, you his holy people, for those who fear him lack nothing. The lions may grow weak and hungry, but those who seek the Lord lack no good thing. Come, my children, listen to me. I will teach you the fear of the Lord. Whoever of you loves life and desires to see many good days, keep your tongue from evil and your lips from telling lies. Turn from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. The eyes of the Lord are on the righteous, and his ears are attentive to their cry. But the face of the Lord is against those who do evil, to blot out their name from the earth. The righteous cry out, and the Lord hears them. He delivers them from all their troubles. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those who are crushed in spirit. The righteous person may have many troubles, but the Lord delivers him from them all. He protects all his bones, not one of them will be broken. Evil will slay the wicked. The foes of the righteous will be condemned. The Lord will rescue his servants. No one who takes refuge in him will be condemned. Thank you for joining us as we explored Psalms 34. This chapter beautifully illustrates the themes of trust, deliverance, and the goodness of God. We hope you found comfort and inspiration in its verses, reminding us to seek the Lord in times of trouble and to praise Him continually. If this reading resonated with you, please like this video, subscribe for more scripture readings, and share your reflections in the comments. Until next time, May the peace and joy of the Lord be with you always. God bless. Thank you for the continued love and support from each and every one of you. God has truly blessed us, and we hope you all have been enjoying the content. We would like to share our favorite Bible verses with you. Isaiah 53, 5 But he was pierced for our transgressions. He was crushed for our iniquities. The punishment that brought us peace was on him, and by his wounds we are healed. Isaiah 55, 8 through 9. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways, declares the Lord. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. Revelation 22, 21. The grace of the Lord Jesus be with God's people. Deuteronomy 1, 29 through 31. Then I said to you, do not be terrified, do not be afraid of them. The Lord your God, who is going before you will fight for you as he did for you in Egypt before your very eyes and in the wilderness there you saw how the Lord your God carried you as a father carries his son all the way you went until you reached this place Jesus loves you Jesus loves you Jesus loves you Jesus loves you